we got dodgeball. Yeah, I know. It's kind of cheesy, but whatever. I like it, okay? Criticize me if you will. Dog Soldiers. Not a lot of people know about this movie, but it's really cool. I mean, it's a werewolf movie. Plus, it's like, like as it says, it's like Jaws and Alien and Predator wrapped into like an amazing movie. Like, it's cool. I was pretty surprised by it. And right after a good movie, we have to show a shitty movie, Dolls. This movie is really shitty. Like, I'm talking bad shit. Like, I like cheesy movies, but this is, like, this is extreme cheese. Like, this is complete shit. But I have it for the fact that it's so bad, it's hilarious. Like, you watch this with friends, and it's funny as hell, I'm telling you. Do it. Okay. I'm not a huge fan of anime, but I have Dragon Ball Z, all the Brawly episodes. Why? Because Brawly is a crazy motherfucker. Like, look at this guy. He starts off regular, and then BOOM! Giant. Crazy. Anyway, yeah. I liked him, so I got this set. And it's in a cool tin case. Cool tin case. Alright. We got Earth Girls Are Easy. Really awesome movie. I mean, it's got Goldblum in it. It's got Jim Carrey in it. It's got one of the Waynes brothers in it. Sorry, his name escapes me right now, um, Damon Waynes, yeah, he's awesome, they're playing the aliens there, they're furry, and then they're not furry, I'm not gonna ruin that, what goes on there, but it's cool, Gina Davis is in this as well, it's really awesome, totally cool, check it out, uh, got eight crazy nights in this holiday slider case thingy, I like this movie, okay, Adam Sandler in it, I'm not usually a huge musical fan, but it's pretty cool, El Dorado, this is awesome, man, like, I remember this movie hardcore, so I had to grab it, this was actually, um, my girlfriend paid for this one, it was really awesome of her, she got it for me, it was like, yeah, yeah, love El Dorado, we got Emperor's New Groove, Emperor's New Groove, I mean, come on, David Spade is awesome in this movie, Employee of the Month, another gift from the girlfriend, really cool, I like this movie, yeah, not a, not a lot of people did, but I like it. Just saying. We got uh, Euro Trip, Road Trip. Love both these movies, so buying them like this was not even a question. Like, just do it. We got. Oh, whoa! Almost knocked over my whole shelf. All right. We got Evil Dead, and I got this really cool like three disc edition that came with like a little booklet and this poster and everything. Totally awesome, full of features, and look how big this thing is it's like a look at it it's giant like in comparison to all the other dvds that's pretty huge i mean like whoa I'm trying to juggle it put it back in there of course if i have evil dead and army of darkness i gotta have evil dead too because it's just awesome awesome movie we got evolution i got this way back in like a bargain bin it's pretty cool fantastic four yeah, Fantastic Four. We got Fight Club. Really good movie. I was surprised. I didn't think I'd like it just because I don't really like Brad Pitt. But because of this movie, I like Brad Pitt. So, figure that one out. That and Cool World. Just saying. Final Destination 1, 2, and 3. I don't really like this this set. But that's just because, like I said, I'm kind of a special features whore. But that's not the main reason. The main reason is because I got this set... Because I couldn't find one and two everywhere. Like, anywhere. I couldn't find it anywhere. I mean, and I had this one. And this one has a really cool little animated short in the second disc. So I didn't want to get rid of it. And now the first two are almost everywhere. I mean, this, the second one is, is everywhere. But the first one I still have a hard time hunting down. So if I find the first one, I'm going to grab the second one. And I'm probably going to give this away. I got the fly. Yeah, really cool. Gotta love this one. So awesome. Jeff Goldblum's amazing in this movie. And I got the two disc, really awesome set, really awesome features showing how they made the movie. And Fly 2, yeah, Fly 2, not as good as the first one, but still pretty good. I got this on DVD. I know Jex has these on VHS, but I got these on DVD. And this one, I really gotta say, like, it might not have been the most amazing. It was, it was pretty good, not as good as the first, but it has a really cool documentary in the DVD, like in the second disc, all about the original Flies. It's really cool. Right next row. We got Four Brothers, pretty decent, not the best movie ever. We got Freddy Got Fingered, love this movie. And we got Freddy vs. Jason, not the same Freddy, but you know what I'm saying. 
Really, I, I like that movie. You know, a lot of people think Freddy vs. Jason was, was cheesy and not good, but I like it, yeah. Ghostbusters 1 and 2. Yeah, you guys have heard about that already. It's awesome, okay? There's not much more I can say. The Goonies. I love the Goonies. Uh, Alright, uh, we got Grandma's Boy here. It's kind of, it's pretty much a stoner comedy, but I mean, it's awesome. It's got a, a lot of things I like in here. It's got video games, it's got monkeys. Yeah, it has a monkey in here. I mean, come on. Video games, crazy antics, a monkey. It's just a lot of funny situations. Really awesome. Um, we got Gremlins and course. Man, I really hate those cases. <clears throat> Gremlins 2. Now, what I'm talking about, I hate these fucking cases. The, like, these cases are making me angry right now. These ones. Why? They latch on to your other DVDs, and they just suck. I mean, even, like, if you have a bunch of these cases, they latch on to each other. So what was the point? Anyway, just saying. Gremlins and Gremlins 2. I love the Gremlins. They are awesome. Alright, we got... The Hangover, really cool movie. I got the uh, the whole two disc stuff because you can get the unrated version on this, which is a lot better than the cut version. So I'm told, so I went for it, you know. Which I'm pretty sure because that was an awesome version. Got the Haunting in Connecticut. This was actually a pretty darn scary movie. It was pretty decent, so I got it for cheap. We got Heckler. This is actually a really cool com like a uh, documentary. It's all about. Um, you know, hecklers, as it says, and you know, being a big fan of, like, the entertainment and comedy industry, that was a really interesting look on how some people are just jerks. You got Hellboy. I haven't seen Hellboy 2 yet, but this is awesome, so I really want to get around to checking it out. There's no Hellboy suite. You got Hercules. I love Hercules. This was, like, my whole childhood right here. Disney movies, a lot of these ones I have in here in animated movies was, like, my childhood, and this was a big part. I remember seeing this in the drive-in. Like, I love this movie. I still do. It was a gift, by the way. Someone sweet. I mean, that was my girlfriend, in case you didn't get it. I'm going to stop saying who I got the movies from now, though, because I just realized I got a lot of movies from from lots of friends, and I'm just like, if I forget one, I'm going to feel like an asshole, so I'm going to stop now, okay? So I got... His name was Jason. This is actually, it's a pretty decent documentary. It's just, I think I was expecting a lot more when I got it. Oh, look at that, it's really cool. It came with a poster. So it's really good. And I mean, a lot of the stuff is in here is really awesome. It's got James and Nintendo in here. Yeah, when he does the review of the game. It's on the second disc, I believe. But yeah, no, it's pretty decent. It's worth at least checking out, you know. I'm all disoriented. Sorry, I poked at the wrong case and everything. You got Hook. Yeah, I remember watching this as a kid, and I liked it, so I grabbed it. It's pretty sweet. We got, um... Honey, We Shrunk Ourselves, and Honey, I Blew Up the Kid in a double pack. I figured I'd snatch it. I mean, both of them are... Well, this one's pretty bad, but I mean, both of them are pretty interesting. I just gotta get the first one, which is pretty hard to track down. Honey, I, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids? Hard to find, but I will find it. Give it time. Hot Fuzz. This is an amazing movie. This is like, Hot Fuzz is awesome. I mean, it might be slow to pick up, but man, the action in it and stuff, and the comedy is just great, but I mean, the action at the end, holy crap. Hot Rod. This is like, Hot Rod is one of my favorite comedies, okay? This is great. Andy Samberg is like one of my heroes, and this is brilliant. Plus, like, the commentary is hilarious on there, and a lot of the behind the scenes is great. We got... Howard the Duck. Oh my god, what a bad movie. I love this movie, though, for the cheesiness. It's got a lot of cool special features saying how they did it, in case you really wanted to know. It's in there. It's brilliant. I can't believe Lucasfilm made that. I'm just saying. Star Wars. Oof, man. Like, how could they make Howard the Duck? Anyway, I'm glad they did, because it's awesome. We got The Incredible Hulk. This is awesome. Okay, I had the original Hulk somewhere. It's not far from here, but this... This is brilliant. I'm a huge comic book fan, so I'm just saying. Brilliance. I got I Love You Man. Really good movie. I liked it. Saw it in the theater. It was cool. In the theater. 